Hey, welcome back. In this episode, we're going to learn about how can you migrate from Teams Foundation version control TFVC to Git in Azure repos. My name is Sushant Sudish and I am your trainer for this AZ400 certification course. Without wasting any more time, let's get into it. All right, so let's start with understanding how can you migrate the tip. Most team wish they could recognize their source control structure. Typically, the structure the team is using today was set up by a well-meaning developer a decade ago, but it's not really optimal. Migrating to Git could be a good opportunity to restructure your repo. In this case, it probably doesn't make sense to migrate history anyway since you are going to restructure the code. The process is simple. Create an empty Git repo, then get latest from TFS and copy and copy the code into the empty Git repos. Then you just commit and push, you are there. Of course, if you have shared code, you need to create build of the shared code to publish to a package feed and then consume those packages in downstream applications. But the Git part is really simple. And if you are on TFVC and you are in Azure DevOps, then you have the option of a simple single branch import. You can click on import repository from the Azure repos. Then enter the path to the branch you are migrating and select if you want history or not. You can keep up to 180 days and add in a name for the repo and the import will be triggered. Import repository also allow you to import a Git repository. This is essentially useful if you are looking to move your Git repository from GitHub or any other public or private hosting spaces into Azure repos. To make it easier for you to switch from TFSC to Git, Azure DevOps Server now provides an out-of-the-box migration workflow called Import Repository. The Import Repository option can be reached from the Code Hub. This allows you to migrate a TFVC repository into Git with history. This is an example which shows how you can do the import. Now let's look into how you can authenticate to Git in Azure repos. Git credential managers simplify authentication with your Azure DevOps service and TFS Git repos. Credential managers let you use the same credential that you use for the Azure DevOps services and support multi-factor authentication through Microsoft account or Azure Active Directory. In addition to supporting MFA with Azure DevOps services, the credential manager also provides support two-factor authentication with GitHub repositories. So for Windows, you can download and install the latest Git for Windows installer, which includes the Git credential manager for Windows. Make sure to leave the Git credential manager installation option enabled when prompted. On Mac OS and Linux, there are several install options that use native package managers to install the credential manager. That concludes this lesson. In the next video, we're going to look into module 2 knowledge check. I will see you in the next one. Until then, take care.